Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. We get more gameplay on CC once again, and I basically have some something really big planned. And it isn't like something that usually will happen in any video, so basically, um right now I got a lot of good members on. We got 32 33 members actually, sorry. Um we do have a lot of people on. I there is actually one person I did not know he was on, but he just came on. Um, that's JJBB. He's new to the guild as well because he, he didn't really donate that many shards. Well, even though the Fanny Cookie and the other guys have came out and they've been here longer, they just don't donate that much. But but yeah, you want to come join um, Megopolis, please come join. I'm thinking that my apprentice guild is going to be changed into... Mega City because Megapolis means if you haven't found out that Megapolis means um, the family of all nations and then Mega City means pretty much the same thing. So people, um, I'm just this guy I actually don't know. I'm just gonna text him out because I don't even know who he is. But all right, so now this is all about the Lost Realm again. So, uh, in this video, I'm going to be doing the pretty much a really long video, and it's going to be using these 12 stamina cards right here. And I want to use them up first because I need to open these things up, but I'm maxed with warehouse, so I basically can't um, like open them up because I had to use 100 gems just to increase my thing, so... So, um, how's he gonna say? Oh, so I'm not really going to open them up because I need to increase the warehouse. And I'm not gonna buy any money because I hate when people say, I hate when I buy money sometimes because people say it's the worst video like the last video was. I did hate that comment, but what can you do about it? That will once happen in your channel if you do have one, so that's best of luck, so. We're going to go ahead and just use these 12 stamina cards on this Lost Realm. So if you do the math, I think you get 480 stamina, so that is incredibly insane. I've been guarding my bow altars lately, because they're really important. So here's your setup, guys. You want to find out a setup to basically just just occupy um, Storm Mesa, I mean not Storm Mesa, um, Lost Realm. Basically, you need air, your Aries to, what is it, 6 or 9. That is the main thing. If you don't have this person, you need to get Minotaur. You must have Fun to God, Pumpkin Duke. Now, you can have Druid if you want to, because he's a really good healer. Besides that, you could use Orspain if you want to, if you have him. So, right here, usually I will lose this one because, um, well, Vlad Dracula got a proc off first, but... What makes my team so really hard to beat, like you see right here, I'm beating all these 8 star, 9 star heroes, like the high ones, because my my Minotaur has that uh, 2.5 stun, Ares has that, what do you call it, that 3.5 disabling skill, and there's Fun to go with the 1.5 stun, that's what it is. And then Pumpkin Duke will tank on the right side, usually making him being uh, going after him instead of Minotaur. Because Minotaur, if you haven't noticed, is a slow person usually. So, so he just ran out of some stamina. So we're gonna use these two cards to get them out of the way. That's why this video is being made. Now this is the highest amount of stamina cards I ever used. So it's gonna be a heck of a long video. So. Hope you guys do enjoy that though, it's just really incredible. And I can't open those things up, so I'm gonna keep going until maybe get a gold key. Hopefully, I'll get one. So, a new update I heard it's gonna be at the end of this month. You have if you're worrying about the new update, it's gonna come out either the end of the month or the beginning of the next uh, the next month. So, it's gonna be one of them. So, I'm gonna go ahead and figure out. I can't open that. I'm gonna attack this this little attack right here. I'm trying to find a heavy setup instead of uh, six stamina ones. Cause I don't really 
like like these little ones because they're too easy and all that what else can you do here's a shaman mm, he'll attack it because I have a lot of stamina cards I could use so if you want to always win not always win but pretty much win every time in a lost world you must have your Aries skill up if you have one only that's just the main key there's a paladin over there, but I'm gonna get to that one later. Here we go. Now my Ares does have that four or five evite, making him really proc the first over Minotaur because he has a slower attack than him. We got some gold and stuff. Here is a werewolf. Not a good one either. But here we go. Now what makes my Thunder God, if you haven't noticed also, he has a 4-5 Berserk. Not the best, but you know, it's a, it's a Berserk on Thunder God. It's just a really good one for him. So, let's see. Free and free. I'll go this one. Now he's a 9 setup. Let's do this. Now there will be times like if I have heavy stamina ones, I have to put Vlad Dracula instead of Ares because his assailing skill is not gonna last that much long because 3.5 seconds is kind of kind of long but at the same time kind of short. We got a silver key that time, so let's go to this one. A little setup. The next one's a paladin though, so that's good. Minotaur stuns. If you really want these the enemy heroes not to proc or anything, like to make them less have to proc, you gotta get a scatter in one of your heroes in the lost realm. Really, like you have to. Nine setup like usual. So basically, um, Adrid has a revive. Even though it's not the best talent, but. If he goes down, he still has more chance to heal in case if they go after a different person that's alive. That's why I have that revive on him, so. If I get like a Berserk on him, a Life Drain, besides Vlad Dracula, obviously. Then I'll pretty much put it on Druid because it's the best idea. He's the last 6 setup, and then I gotta go get some more cards. Ares and Minotaur stun. Good thing Thunder God's on the right side of Pumpkin Dude, because if Pumpkin Dude gets stunned, he, Thunder God would just replace that stun for for him, so. You have a lot of people on right now. So, I'm just looking at the messages right now, so. Alright, so, people have questions for the boss. I did do the boss earlier, because, because he, if you haven't, because my, if you haven't looked at my guild, uh, I basically stole boss one, I didn't really want to do two, and I could do three easily, like, three is really easy to do. I, I, <clears throat> I'm going to put, I can solo all three bosses, I can solo all three bosses, guys, so. So, people wanted to do boss, but I have a certain time to do it, so I'm so sorry to say that, but what other choice is there? I just follow my guild plans. It's just simple, just, just don't be in the boss, or just, or just miss the boss, it's that easy. So, let's go ahead and do more Lost Realm. Here we go, all stamina's refilled. Let's keep on going. Next next uh, stamina refill coming up. I do like how IGG did put out the stamina cards every day because because if I don't have any videos to make, usually I'll just do these because it's really use of the time, so let's go to this panda. Here's a nine setup finally, something else.
Another bronze key. I, I can't even use them, so it doesn't even matter. Uh, let's go to this one right here. Alright, here's a nice setup. Now we got the second misses coming in. So I'm gonna do is stun, but once finally got proc, so you'll give him a chance to proc. There we go. Minotaur is gonna go down, but that's fine because Minotaur only stuns. That's the only thing I have him out. No Serpent Queens, like always, I have to keep eye on them because they could have something good, they could have something bad, you don't know. So far, we haven't seen any really big setups like Botanica or, like, I really want to beat one of those things, so maybe we'll find one. There's a Serpent Queen all over there, but here's one right here. Not a good one either, so... Next gameplay, let's see. Mana time. He's a ninja, so I already know there's a 12 setup. That's a good one. But to be safe, I know Vlad Dracula can defeat this, so. Like, Ares could cause problems. I'm not even sure why, but he could cause problems in this. Alright, so, they're still talking about boss, so, that's good, because it's guild thing, so that's good. He's a ninja, let's do this. Now, there's a chance I can get the gold key from this one, but sometimes I could get the bronze key, which is so horrible. I know I can defeat this, because Vlad Dracula has all that stun, and all that damage causing, and nothing's gonna happen. Got a bronze key, like I thought, so. Triton. I should have ran down instead, but I found a 9 setup, so. The other one was a 6 setup, so. So, like I said, this video is going to be a long one, because I'm just taking time up. Bronze key again. Ninja time. Here's another setup of those, but I have to refill stamina. I have to. Here we go. Uh, let's see, where is it? I gotta sell these things because if you see my warehouse is actually over the max. So I have to get rid of these stamina cards as fast as possible. Alright, next one. Let's do this. So pretty much all my bow altars are occupied since I got them all cleared up. So here we got Snowzilla and Ninja and Ninja Time. So good ones, but it could be it could be give me bad stuff. I have seen it give me like a gold the the rare gold packages, you know the the fifty thousand ones. I only really care about the gold in this game. And another bronze key again. Just wasting time. Here we go again with an another uh, um, level 6 again. Minotaur stuns. Now, it could go a lot faster if Ares around, but it doesn't really matter. Triton right beside me. Not a good one. Oh, my battery's gonna get low, so. My battery's at 15, okay. Bronze key again. At least we're getting that experience points to get faster into the last round 15, which is really nice to see. I think that's when you see more spear mages and all that stuff, so that's good. But hopefully one day we'll get there. But not in this video, we're not going to. Let's go to this one. Alright, not a good one, but okay. 
I'm just gonna keep attacking until I see a Maltanica one. I'm just gonna go after it and see if I can beat it. Because I have to test myself to see if Ares, that skill, is gonna help out. I haven't seen one lately. I, I wonder if they updated or something. Painda. Here's a 9 setup. Here we go, and Black Dracula just stuns everybody so, so they can't move that much. So there's still no Maltanica one or any or something like that. Vlad stuns. Once Vlad procs, pretty much over. And every time I do this, so and I keep getting bronze keys. I actually rather have what do you call it? Um, gold and mana because I I want to sell them because I don't need mana or gold. It's called raiding in these days. Werewolf this way. Last six set up, and then I gotta do the next one. So, so it's gonna take a lot of refills, guys. So if this video is long, it's long. What are you gonna do about it? Let's go to that shaman. Right. So three people talked. Alright, so, uh, let's see, mm -mm 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 -mm. more stamina cards coming out, next refill, let's do this, I'm sitting on top of a shaman, so let's just beat it up, So pretty much, you know, since Vlad and Ares almost have the same level skill, it doesn't really matter which one you put out, but I recommend Ares if you're going against battle altars. If, like if you have trouble, you gotta get an Ares if you don't have one. That's just my tips to you guys if you don't have one. Because without Ares, you, you basically can't stop Lost Realm. You can't. That disabling skill makes a difference. And totally, if you have fun to go a heavy berserk, that would make it different. There's a druid all the way down there, but I don't feel like... You know what, just go down there. 9 setup. I want to see a 12 so bad. But usually you would see Snowzilla and Ninja on the screen, not like Ice Demon and stuff. So let's see. Next one. This is gonna be a long video. I just can see it. You're just gonna if you guys are getting bored of the video, you're just gonna understand that I'm probably not gonna get run into our Maltanica or anything. You can pretty much tell because just using all the stamina cards for basically nothing but a Mortanica. But I can never find one because they're so rare. But if you go higher, I do know you see them more so. And not only just the easy one, but the harder ones. So, I'm trying to beat this setup if I can. Come on, thank you. Assassin. Not a good one. Assassin setups are never good at all. Like, i never seen one that's really good. Like, 9 setup. They're, like, horrible. Paladin time. Alright. 
Nine star with a champion, so that's good. Ch I, I actually rarely see a champion in these setups. But I have Vlad to take care of, take care of them because he has that stun in the fear. And that's how you overrun this little lost realm attack. And I got three mana packs right there. Mm -mm. Hey, uh, that's my, that's the guy that I said he was going to make fearless, but it said that the name was taken, so. Um, so. Uh, mm -hmm. There's so much people to talk to, but, you know, I had to get on with the video. I probably should have started earlier, but hopefully this video gets in through, because I think there's a certain amount of um, minutes that I can film. I'm not even sure. So, keep getting gold and mana just for giggles. Here's a 12 setup. Good one. Come on. Gotta get out of this. Hmm. Mm -mm. Okay, I gotta get. I'm gonna. I have a lot of gold mana in here, but I had to use these stamina cards up because it's a lot more worth it than selling it for 1,000, whatever you want to call it. Um, what do you call it? 1,000 blue crystals. Paladin. Hopefully, we can get a gold key from this one. I want a gold key so bad. Just give me one gold key. Just one. And I don't care if I get like something really bad like gold or something. Just give me something. I do like how we do massive damage because of the inscriptions. You gotta level up the inscri inscriptions if you haven't. I can see that PD died because of the damage going down, and you see that little soul right there. Paladin's gonna keep tanking, and now he's finally gone, thank god. And I didn't get anything, I just got that little key again. This one. So we got this, uh, this refill right here, and then we have two more stamina cards. Then I'm automatically gonna end the video, guys. And I hope you guys please like and subscribe and peace. And like always. Because I hope you guys do enjoy the videos. Because honestly, a good one. So, this setup right here. Usually the worst ones because it's assassins. I hate them. Well, we're, going, we're just going at the Lost Realm 15. That's all it matters from my channel so far. There's a Serpent Queen at the Keep Eye and Doze. Executioner sometimes, sometimes it's good. But rarely, not as much as Serpent Queens though. Like, Serpent Queens can easily be in any setup. You just gotta keep eyeing them. And they really can just... Let's just say troll you sometimes, maybe. Druid, I'm going backwards. Here's a 9 setup. Come on. Minotaur stuns. Pumpkin Duke procs. Second time procs. Black procs. Thundergraph procs. And you're not gonna move. Sometimes. Except that champion on my, my Minotaur. There you go. Another one. Assassins again. I'm gonna go ahead and go to the assassin. Bad one again. Mm. Like, I just think that IGG should update so you don't see these setups anymore so you can use more stamina because 80 stamina is actually a lot if you have if, if if you don't agree with me. It's actually a lot of stamina. I'm just saying because I think they should have an update like that. I do agree that there might be more 
nine setups, like um, nine stamina setups. But any, by besides that, you still see level six stamina ones. It's just really bad. I don't like seeing them. More mana. Executioner. Oh my gosh. Jeez, we're using these cards kind of fast though, because you have so much. Here we go, come on, come on, come on. Keep going faster. Bronze key. Hmm, anything happen? So I'm just gonna say hey for one second. So he's saying that not only he, um, Python saying, and and Nuker got a Reaper. I'm gonna say Python. Now Python is his friend, and I'm a friend of him, so. Just, just got, what is it, Cupid? Yeah, Cupid. So, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. So, he's saying he has a Cupid, so... I don't see a Cupid yet, so... It's pretty much that the game hasn't updated yet, so... Last two cards, then the video ends, and then I'll go ahead and check out my friends, and that stuff. But anyways, the video is close to ending, so... You guys can watch me if you want to, cause, cause we've been gaining a lot of experience throughout the this, all this stuff basically. Thunder God coming in, and Pumpkin Duke's gonna proc. Here we go, um, Serpent Queen. I'm going all the way over there. So mana again. Mm, I'm gonna go up here. Maybe there's something good. I'm not even sure. The Triton might have a, something good. Cause Triton might have that nine set of a druid ice demons and all that. So let's see. Come on. Here we go. Next one. Executioner and Triton. I have to check on this one's not a good one it's the bad triton one i'll say minotaur stuns minotaur stuns again at least we are going as fast as we can in this in all of this so here we got the paladins again We're finally at halfway stamina, so we're getting closer and closer to the end. Oh my gosh. How did just go down? Champion, that's that nine set of I fought, so. Here we go, keep on going. Thunder God strikes, Vlad strikes, Thunder God strikes. Thunder God's gonna keep rocking if if Funky Beast gonna stack like usual. Gold. It's nothing really much I can get out of this, so let's keep on going. 18 stamina left after this little attack right here. Executioner, maybe be the last one, and it's not gonna be the last one, maybe. 
because there could be a nine setup, there could be a six setup. I don't even know. Maybe I'll, un I'll end it right here for you guys because this video is so long. I don't even know how many minutes it is, so let's see. Oh my gosh. Execution over here. I'm not even going to attack it, so. My friend actually got Cupid. So that is all for this video, you guys. Hope you guys did enjoy. Please like and subscribe. And peace. And I'll talk to you guys in the next video. And I hope you guys have a nice day.